Hello, hello there. General Kenobis. How are you all this fine day? Today I'm gonna make some pixel art and you're gonna watch and chip in if you want to. If you don't want to, you don't have to. It's all good vibes here. Just uh, let me just do the, I'm gonna real quick start this thing then, okay. Um, let me just turn on my music. It's our one of our themes for Red Run. Uh, it's one of our games that we've only we have an alpha for it on itch. If anyone is curious to go and play it, and there isn't much of anyone here yet, but I'll for po for, for uh, posterity I'll announce it. Yeah, for YouTube's. Uh, is the song? Is the sound? How's the sound doing, guys? Can the music isn't too loud. I'm gonna. It's a little too loud for me. I'm just gonna put it down here and then up it here. How is it that? Huh? Song isn't too distractive. Okay. So today. We're gonna work on pixel art. Surprise, surprise. <laughs> what we're doing today though, is something I haven't done on stream yet, which is we're going to create a character based on a portrait, because our game will have character portraits, you know? Like when you're talking to characters and like NPCs, friendly NPCs and such. Like a lot of RPGs do actually. And uh, it just so happened that a few portraits were done before I had done their their in-game sprites. So I'm gonna make their in-game sprite. I'm gonna do Varga, which is a friendly NPC dwarf who is uh, the owner of an inn where the player can rest and regain their statuses. I'm think I'm not, I'm not sure if it's just health or I think they also get stamina back stuff like that uh, and uh, she's also married to our boy the blacksmith so they're little so here's a little little hint little something that we may or may not do can't confirm because it's not done yet but yeah I might it might be important to be friendly with these NPCs you know so that you can have some advantages. And that's all I'm gonna say, for now at least. One day, who knows? Maybe I'll probably figure it out. It's pretty, it'll be pretty easy to figure out. I think that's the, we want the players to understand that the world has connections and that's why, you know, this isn't just any in character, in owner character. She's related to another character that you will actually visit quite often more often than you'd go to the inn, maybe. I don't know, you could go to the inn more often than that, I don't know, it's up to you. Yeah. But um, yeah, it's a full lush world that's full of interesting, fun characters. Plus this portrait is just badass. We just wanna, wanna show us, show, ah, oh, ah. Oh. Look at the beauty, the le lady. This was done by my lady, marketing gal. She's real good at this stuff. Adix, Adix. Uh, today we're gonna try and do her, and if time will allow it, which I think it will, I don't think this will take too long, we'll also do my boy Riazand, I think it was his name, Riazand. Riazand. He's a uh, cartographer? Yeah, cartographer. He gives you your first map, and uh, I think you... I think you, you do map related stuff with him, you know, it's a car he's a cartographer That's uh, about it as, I'm, as much as I'm gonna reveal. He's got these cool glasses I have no idea how I'm gonna do this in in the pixel art style that we've been doing, but we'll find out when we get there Right now we're gonna start with our gal The Varga, Varga was her name, yeah, Varga portrait, here it is before I start, I guess maybe I should. Uh... Oh yeah, let me check the the 
chat, the chat, we have five viewers. Hello, five viewers. Thank you all for coming. We have yikes. We have a we have a yikes. We have a fuck. We have a. <laughs> many emotions in this chat right now. Uh, someone has problems with their with their ads. Five card. I'm sorry, my man. Internet doesn't like 180p only quality stream. Want me to change that? I don't. No, they won't. There's no way to doing. It. Okay, thank you. Uh, no spoils, maybe, maybe, yeah, yeah. Me referring to that. Lots of suffering wheels. Works on seconds to sec. Uh, buffering wheels, okay. Suffering wheels. <laughs> buffering wheels are kind of suffering wheels in their own right, you know. Just make the glasses. He gets the eyes on the portrait. Yeah, true, true. Uh, that's something fun about these pixel art. Yes, the wheels of suffering. <laughs> But yeah, it's something fun about this ty that type of pixel art is that, I mean, if someone has glasses, they don't have eyes. Because uh, glasses are enough. But yeah. Uh, I should maybe also mention, like, do I'm going to do put in a, little, a few more minutes in just uh, dicking around since there's five people. But let's wait just a little bit longer. I'm going to give you my recommendation of an indie game since uh, our friend... The our boy, the programmer, five card keeps. He always does that. His recommendation. I'm gonna go and do my recommendation, which is, I guess, the only the indie game I've been playing lately. This is Heaven Dust. It's a Heaven Dust is uh, made by a studio in China, which I forget what their name was. Uh, Heaven Dust. Oh, thank you. So you can have the chat. Thank you so much. Milady Marketing Gal just gave me a better access view to the chat. Heaven Dust is what I was talking about, though. Heaven Dust is a game. Show it, though. I'm a, I don't have it on my computer. I have no, it on. But show what you're searching instead of just always having the the eye of sight open. Wait, it's not. It's not. Show it. Wait, what? Yeah, why is sight? I should be. Sh up. Uh. Let me minimize. Thank you. Okay. Uh, it's because I got I got everything on. Uh, so I was just, I just wanted to get uh, screen capture, and I had every capture on. So can you see it now? Uh, we can see the, the thing. Yeah. No. Okay. Okay. Yeah. This is Heaven Dust. It's a nice, nice little game. It's been described as um, the cute Resident Evil, which is kind of right, I guess. The characters are all like cutesy type of thing. It's on an isometric view, not orthogonal view, because it's slightly tilted, just like my mind. I'm tilted. And uh, it's uh, done by, it was created by Indie Nova, which is an in a Chinese developer. Mad props to them. It's uh, it's not a perfect game, but it's got a lot of charm. It's fun, especially if you like them 90s, those 90s um, survival horror games, you know? You had the, all the lots of puzzles, exploring a building that's full of monsters, that sort of shit. It's fun. Maybe I'm the only one who finds it that fun, but I don't know. If enough people are interested. That they have now a second game coming out, a second Heaven Dust. The demo's already available on Steam. I've played a bit of it. It's pretty cool. Wait, it's a new studio. I don't know, but the first game was pretty cool. Second game seeming to become better. So I don't know. Check them out. That's my indie recommendation. It's probably not going to be as popular, but it's a nice game. It's a nice. Uh, so the chat is talking about how the stream is horror. Yeah, for five card. I heard five card recommendation and then buffers. Yeah, because he's constantly like the internet's going down, so it's suspenseful for him. He only hears like the beginning. Ah, uh, okay. Time. General Kenobi's gods uh, said, it's "So cute, it's horror." Well. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> I mean, it's you're not gonna get. Re it's it's cute horror, so it's not really horror, but you're not exactly getting scared or. 
creeped out by uh, disturbing monster designs or anything, but it's... It's horror in the sense that it's structured like horror. And there's a jump scares here and there, like, oftentimes, like, uh... I don't know, the closet opens and a zombie jumps out of it, that sort of stuff. Uh, yeah. And, uh, what else did he say? Five kind of things he said about this way, stream is thriller. Yeah, yeah, that's the uh, cliffhangers. True, true, true. But yeah, uh... That's uh, all there is to what I was saying. So since I've made a little bit of time, I'm gonna get to work. Now the reason I have this bad boy open here, he's not even her husband, she's cheating on him. But uh, this guy is a dwarf, another dwarf. It's, I think it's the first dwarf I made. I've pretty'd him, pretty'd him up a little since this first appearance in the alpha. Uh, his beard is now a lot more luscious. Can't you see the lusciousness of the beard in these squares? Uh, but yeah, I'm using him basically as a starting st structure point so that I know like the size that I want this dwarf lady to have. I don't want her to be taller than him. I mean, Scarlet's taller because she's a human. Dwarfs are about the same height. I don't know if there's much of a... Maybe there's slightly taller dwarfs or not and slightly shorter dwarfs, but... I mean, they're dwarfs, man. I don't think... I'm sorry to all the little people out there, but this is like mythology, magically dwarf, fantasy dwarfs, okay? They don't have... I don't know. Real life stuff. Yeah, real life stuff. Yeah, they're in another magical creature, just like a bunch of other magical creatures we're gonna have in this world. In fact, they're some of the cutest magical creatures in this world, let's say. Yeah. Except maybe, I mean... Again, the luscious beard. I gotta, I have to bring that out. <laughs> yeah, like uh, our, our, like our resident lore expert, Five uh, Wolf Wolfer, who's also our character killer, saying, yeah, they stay tiny for the most part. I think the only ones that are shorter than them are the gnomes, and that's really more of a differentiator between species, I guess. Uh. Tallest dwarf I've ever seen in a fantasy setting was basically the size of an average sized human and it was considered a giant by dwarven standards. No. Nice. Okay. That's cool to know that the, there's... Maybe maybe I'll... If I go with a different art style for Exaudia 2, I'll make taller dwarfs. But for now, let's stick these this size. And uh, let's get to work on her. Let's try and make her. So for starters, I'm gonna grab some colors here and uh, amp up that brush. Cause I wanna start off with uh, a bit, wait. Oh yeah, this is a two pixel size. Okay, wait, give me a sec. Let me just, uh, this sprite. Sprite size. I'm gonna put this at 50% because uh, it's a slight. This is a slightly bigger PNG that I brought in, which isn't very helpful when you're trying to make like only pic pixels. You know, this. If the pix if the picture is bigger, I'm gonna end up needing to use two pixels at once. Might not. It might not all fit perfectly together. So yeah, scale. Scale's important. Who would have known? I sure didn't fuck fucked hard me back. I, mean, I swear to God, guys, when I look back at some of the shit that I did with pixel art, especially when I look back at that alpha from Ex Exaudio's alpha, like Jesus, what was I thinking? The hell was wrong with me? Okay, but let's uh, let's say that their heads. This guy has a bigger beard than the, than the lady does. <laughs> She was Portuguese. Maybe she, maybe she'd have a similar beard, but hey, hey. hey. So let's just start with a an average okay, look for her. Like, let's try and just fill in the the blanks where her stuff would be. We know that she has hair on top of her head, so just uh, something here, a little something there. No, that's uh, okay. This okay. okay, 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 okay. Sh 
sure, that seems right. No, it doesn't. <laughs> uh, I, don't know. I just wanna... Okay, yeah, that's it. That's about the same on both sides. About. Okay. And uh, she has this nice little outfit. That's some, this is the, what, what, what do we call these? Uh, uh, it's kind of like a poncho, I guess. It's a poncho? I thought it was a, um, God, I only know this word in Portuguese. Shail? What's, what's that in English? I think that's a poncho. Is it a poncho? Really? I thought shiles were like, just the scarfish, scarfish looking things. Okay. So let's just, uh, assuming it's a poncho, so, and then. Uh, let's do that there, and she... I don't know what her oh, pants... It's a shawl. It's a shawl. Ha-ha. A shawl. Ha. A shawl. A shawl. Morning. 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 Okay, so I'm just gonna fill that in there. Okay, and I think we have enough to work with on this basis, this base blob. I always do the base blob first. So that I can sort of let shit flow, you know? Turns British. I wonder if I'd get more views if I had a British accent. Wait, no, that turned wrong and there and in the end. I don't even know what accent that is. I don't know, I think I started off on British and then I kind of slid into the... Um, ah, Cockney? Yeah, the, the Cockney accent and then I could just slid into something else that was all new. <laughs> okay, so. Let's think about this, guys. She has some eyes, she has a mouth, she has hair. So let's try and do hair here. So, she has one of those uh, parted halfway type of hairs, you know. You know what I'm talking about, guys, you know. These hairs are cool as hell, man. Uh, is that right? Should I do that? I don't know if I should do that. Let's do this. Okay, yeah. Yeah, so we have this, which is like her uh, braid? Is it a braid? I don't know what this is. It's a braid. Uh, but you're going way too high with the braid. Too high? Yeah. Down the low. light thing near her forehead is just light on the hair, because her hair does like the dividing in the middle fringe. Okay. The, the thingy. Okay. And then underneath is a braid. So like this, I guess? Uh, maybe but I don't know. Maybe just do your thing and then see what happens. Yeah, let's do what we let's see what we go from here. And um uh, I'll start with making the general shape of where her face shadows are gonna be. We're gonna have one near here, near here. Okay, mm. We want her to be cheeky, right? So if she's cheeky, I need to do something like this, right? I don't think that you're gonna be able to do the shadows. I don't know. Well, we'll get to it when we get to it. I don't know, I'm gonna fuck around with it a bit. There is, There really isn't, despite what I put on my title, I don't know if it's still in the title actually, now that I think of it, but uh, I put it. okay. Despite what I put on my title of this stream, I don't really know, per se, what I'm doing. <laughs> I kinda do, but I'm kinda just rolling with it, you know? Maybe my arts teacher should have been more... Should have pressured me a little bit more into actually doing things. You know, the good practices, as one could call them. How to mistreat someone. Yes. 
Kado and my my programming teacher. Everyone, everyone that's ever worked with me. I'm not uber fun to work with, I guess. Ah, come on, don't tell yourself stories. That's not it. Okay, are these braids? This isn't braids. <laughs> these don't look like braids. Let's uh, do on the other side to see if any lights bulbs light up in my head here. Yeah, I need to like leak here, leak here. Huh. Yo, nice. Hello, Andre. How you doing? Boy. How you doing? And welcome very much to our stream. Uh, I don't think we have anyone else. Okay. But in case you were wondering, bet you wonder. Well, I don't know who wonders about this, but yeah, I'm doing pixel art. Yeah, who would have guessed? And I'm trying to make a lady here, a lady who is fancy, but not too fancy. She has weekends. Our only time where I get good sleep. Interesting. Interesting. I mean, I guess that's part of the new dangerous world of employment, right? <laughs> that comes with it, I have to imagine. I didn't, I didn't have many jobs yet in my life, but boy, when... Should... Wait. So, what, what, what? Making her mouth one pixel wide? No, you already made the mouth one pixel. I made it two. Your two? No, no, not wide. Uh, thick version. Oh, uh, thick. Yeah. Only one pixel thick. Fuck. Yeah, because then it's like... <laughs> uh, I don't know, this is giving me that sex vibe. Sex doll, sex dolls vibe. Yeah, I wish it was thinner, but it's impossible. You can't do like half a pixel. Yeah, I know. Maybe just one square instead of two. To give her like a no, no. <laughs> one square, one pixel. <laughs> that was one. Pi How about now? Dude, make the entire mouth one square. I've one done that. Pixel. I've done that. But that was to the side, trying to make it in the middle. I oh, know you can't because it's a pixel. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> ah, this is why I don't work in these pixel sizes. Yeah, it's kind of just uh, a way of getting mad at shit. Yeah, well, for says she looks very surprised about something. <laughs> Are you surprised, lady? Oh yeah, she needs eyebrows, that too. Yeah, that probably might help. I don't know how you're gonna do the eyebrows. Now she kind of looks a little butch. Maybe she butch. should have eyebrows, because her eyebrows are just like super thin. Do her. I didn't do the, the cutesy eyes. How about this, guys? Are these eyes cute? What do you think? Yeah, I think you need to do. Oh, oh wait, does that look good? <laughs> you've, you've, your, stream, right. your stream's gotten to the yeah. big eyes part. I think it's, that might be better, yeah. Well, it is, yeah, it is kind of cute. Yeah, it is kind of cute. Wait, I should open a uh, Scarlet too, so that I can check how I yeah. did with uh, since it's one of the few characters that didn't have a beard. Yeah, and it's what Wolfric says, like the eyes kind of distract from the mouth, make the mouth more opaque. Okay, give me just a sec, you guys. I'm just gonna where is the OGS UGS? Yes, I have a big ass. I have a lot of ton of shit on my computer. It's a little. Not super organized, but okay. Characters, uh, Scarlet, my gal. Let's open her up here. I just need one of you, just one of you, just one. You are a 
that do. Control C, okay. Bye. Control V, wait, no. Shit. New layer. It's okay, I just want to have the reference here. So, what I did with Scarlet, yeah, I think uh, the eyes, the, the, the eye distance isn't good either. Yeah. Yeah, look at him, look at the guy next to her, like, yeah. she looks a little bit childish, maybe, with the eyes that are closed. Okay. So, hmm. I don't know. Did she get a mouth? Wait a moment. The eyes seem off center. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Her whole head is just kind of weird. Yet. Let's uh, leave that on, on hold for now. Leave the mouth on hold. What the fuck is wrong with your head, lady? I don't understand. What's so wrong with my head? Maybe she needs to have a bigger head. I mean, it's like, around the same her size. Upward? Like, give her more forehead? Uh, let's see, one, two, three, four. I did four on her. On Scarlet, I did one, two, three, four. I also did two, four on Scarlet. Oh, I think it's her, maybe her eyes are just too lower, too low. Maybe, that could be it. Need to fill that in now. It still seems kind of weird, I'm not sure why. quick just uh so one two three four five maybe that's it you need to have like six or just particular like zero one two three four five six seven okay i did have too much one two so one two three one two three One, two, three. One, two. I have five. Maybe her head is just too wide, I guess. But it's about as wide as the... Oh, it's because I the other ones don't have any anything in the side, in the side of their eye. So like this. Yeah, that's it. Now I just have to clean up on top. Okay. Okay. Uh, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Now though, I don't need to necessarily do this, right? And I think that works with the roundness of the head. I think I kind of just fucked myself over from the previous designs. Because she has this... Because uh, because I wanted to show off the middle of the head hair parted thing. And now I'm coming to realize that because I only have five pixels on that line of pixels 
it would never look uh, perfectly centered. So maybe I should rethink this part of the hair too? Yeah, that, that's what I was saying in the beginning. Like, maybe you should, like, ignore my shadow work and use your technique because none of the sprites have this sort of shadow that I do. Okay. So let's imagine for a second here that I'm not a complete fuck up. And, uh, okay. And that's too too high for the braid to be. Okay. And also, she kind of has too big of a chin now, so let's back this up. But her face is long. Hmm. I guess. The, this line of pixels here that this guy has, technically the top line is where the mouth is, and the bottom line is where the chin is. So in theory, her chin should be here. That's the chin, nah, that's the mouth, man. Like, it's it's the the whole chunk, you know, the chunk of skin that is between the, bro the mustache and the chin beard. It's that chunk of skin. Yeah, but it's pixelized. Like, I don't know. I think it can read as a mouth. I don't know. What do you think of her face now, though, guys? I think it looks a little bit better. Yeah. Let's go. Okay. And I uh, think I'm going to need to alter some things here. Do we want more braids than that? Yeah, her braids go a little further down. Well, thank you, looking like a very nice lady. I guess my question is, do we want like a lot more? So like down here? Yeah, I guess. More? Here? They should be inwards, though. I think they should be inwards, right? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So let's go with that. The slight outline, boy. You know I love me my shady outline. And this would be shoulder, I think. Right. Right. I think his shoulder can actually go all the way up here. Okay. Okay. It's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. Okay. But is this her body format? If it's a poncho, yes. But I guess I can do this here. I don't know how much is it. Yeah, the poncho lays lower. Yeah, like that. Or should it go lower? I mean, yeah, I'm just trying to understand how would I make a poncho here. I think it's something along those lines. Just don't remember that she has a body underneath. Wait, no, Scarlet, ha Scarlet has a poncho. I'm a fucking retard. Oh, yeah. Just see her. Uh, let's, uh, sprite size, put this at 50%. Uh, do, 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 do. So many Scarlets, oh my gosh. Control C, okay. And now a new layer. Okay, here we are. Fine, we'll cut off her legs, I don't care. Don't save, okay. Okay, so it's not exactly a poncho, what she has. It's a cape that covers only half of her, like the arm and shoulder, but I guess maybe I should have it lo hang lower in general. Even hit this guy's cape thing that also comes to the front 
goes a bit lower so let's take it lower 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 low how low can it go yeah 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 okay that's about it do 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 mm, it's a little too narrow for a poncho i think low 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 See, I think that's more of a poncho, right? Yeah, has the vibe. Nah, this just looks kind of weird. Oh yeah. Uh, to any new viewers, we have six viewers. Hello, six viewers. I don't know who came in, who went out, I don't know what's going on, but thank you all for coming. Right now we're doing some pixel art for our game Exaudia. We had a few characters done, and uh, we also are having have some uh, portraits, you know, game portraits, like when you talk when you talk to characters often in RPGs, a little portrait of the character, a little that goes closer, shows more details, shows up along with the texts so we uh, our girl marketing gal did this character which is a character that our character killer had already written which was uh, Varga she's the wife of the blacksmith who who is who is also uh, the owner of the of an inn where Scarlet can go and rest right now I'm trying to translate her into pixel art so we can have an actual in-game sprite of her because on this one she got to it before i did uh, so what we're doing is that we have to do her i still want to do him too this guy is our cart cartographer he well, you do map-related stuff with him. Like, I think he gives you the, you, the map, and uh, or you buy the map or something. And not too sure how he goes, but I I'm just doing pixels right now. Okay, I don't remember how every character does the thing, but they're all cool. And uh, right now, I'm focused on trying to bring her into dwarf size. As you can see, Scarlet's a bit taller than them. I have her here as a reference too. And uh, I guess I have to get to the, to it then. This is being relatively complicated because of. Oh no! Are you fucking with me? Like this. What do you guys think? This this size poncho or this size poncho? Poncho. It's two sizes. Since this got all split up, I don't know. I think the longer one. Yeah, the longer one looks more like a poncho, right? The shorter one kind of just doesn't look like hanging tissue. Heck, I'm not sure the other one does either, but... Uh, let's... I put that on the wrong layer, so control X and... Uh, yes, you control boom. There you go. How nice, how nice. I want to move you. Move you. There we go. Okay. So we don't have her legs on the portrait. Your bongo cat stopped working for a second. Wait, what? Give it a little open and close. Bongo cat! Bongo cat went to sleep. Where'd you go, bongo cat? Uh, Mitraval. My bongo. I need you, my bongo. Okay, no, this didn't doesn't want to wake up. Okay, now it's awoken. It hath it awoken. So back to it. Uh what we want here, I should think about how her arms are gonna look. We we have this hint of a um, uh what is this? A turtleneck? Uh, something that she has underneath. I thought of a turtleneck, yeah. Okay, 
So let's uh, put her arms with that color. My, my thoughts behind that turtleneck was she basically wears like a long ass turtleneck dress underneath the little shawl poncho thing. Okay. Just as an overall cover. I don't know, it felt medieval to me. Characters were like the way to me. I don't know. I mean, I like the style. I don't think we're gonna have any. Uh, uh, what's the name? Uh, the accurate people who are about accurate uh, historical representation. Yeah, it's not really a historical sense, is it? True that. True that. Okay. So if you, if the way you said it, it's a dress of some kind. You, yeah. how long of a dress were you thinking it is? Oh, I was thinking like long, long. Okay, like but the skirts that the old ladies wear around here to do like field work and stuff. Like all the way down like here. Okay, but the footsies will be out, right? Yeah. And she may be wearing like some kind of heavy duty boots or something because she does do like work. Like she would have to clean the inn and upkeep the inn, so I don't, I, I don't know. know. I thought I don't know why, but I thought I thought sandals. I don't know if sandals are a good idea. <laughs> I mean, it would be just two lines, really. I don't know. Think. I don't know if this. Okay, no, that doesn't really work. I need a difference. You, yeah. Let's get this a little darker. Yeah, I don't like it. Kind of looks weird. Yeah, I don't like it. Boots. Boots. Hmm. Okay. Oh, and I also want to do this. I like this detail here. I want to see if I can pull it, put, pull, bring it in. So it would be like a, this, this child thing opens it up in the middle, right? Maybe I do this. Maybe if you do like a four pixel square as the little thing. I can't really do four, I'm gonna do this. Mm, it's a little still I don't think I should open this much mm. oh. Yeah, maybe it looks too big maybe only one yeah, it's a little too droopy Let's just do that and this Okay yeah, Maybe if you put the darker pixel like I put there in the middle now it might look like the little button There is no middle <laughs> Yeah? What? How about that? Oh fuck yeah, there is no middle. I guess, uh... yeah, maybe not. Maybe not. No? I don't know. Chat! Can do this. Or just this? Like it's a little clickety click? Maybe too big? No need yeah. to get to be middle though. No need to be middle. What do you mean, no need to be middle? It can be off to the side, I think. That's what he means. I don't know. Like that? Or this? If I did it right, did it right. Oh, maybe right. just the one in the middle on top? Like that? No, in the middle. Yeah. Right. Leave it like that for now. Let's okay, continue. okay. And, uh. Should I have another color though? I'm not too sure on that. I'm not sure if I add another color. Wait, I did enjoy these little. Oh, it's a little less. And 
wonder. I wonder, I wonder. Can I pull that off? Little checkers. Huh. I don't know, I kinda like it. What do you what do you guys think? I think it brings in a little bit of that grandma. Vibe, yeah. yeah. I dig, I dig. Plus, it feels homey, homemade. Yeah. What does chat think? Should I have this here? Is that too much? that too much? Just kind of fucking around with the shadows here. I think you should, you should have shadows just like all around her shoulders just so the braids and the check in the poncho don't blend into each other. Because right now they're kind of blending into each other. So like that. Yeah, it kind of looks like shoulder things. Yeah, that kind of looks really like she's buff as fuck. Let me try something. What if I'd make this guy? Wait, that needs to be more on the pink side of things. Why are you... Ah, I see the problem. Uh, I need it to be darker. Yeah, what if I try to do the keep doing the pattern, but it's just you know, it's darker. Still kind of looks like sh shoulder things. Kind of still does look like shoulder things. What if I scrap that and just do this? Have her shoulders go all the way up. Nah, it looks weird. It looks like a vest. Sippy says the woman on top she, uh, looks weird to him. He's an old lady. Don't judge the old lady. Hello, Sippy. Welcome. Once again. We, uh, I'm uh, doing... I'm doing that character, actually. She's uh, Varga. It's the the old, not too old, but you know, healthy old wife of the blacksmith from our game, Exaudia. He's got them cheeks. And I'll probably do this guy afterwards. He's a cartographer who's also a dwarf. With whom you work with. about that? Kind of works, yeah. And basically to use the that color to have a basically be a shadow. It's like the shadow of her head on her the top of her body. Just made some music because I was bored. Made another version of a character to animate easier so I can use that character in videos if I want. Oh, hell yeah, no, that's a cool idea, man. Here at home, we love it when, uh, when the, uh, well, video, kind of video content producers, that, 
Would that be the... Yeah. We love it when video content producers put like an animated character with them. I don't know, maybe it's... Stupid of me, but I like it. <laughs> Okay. Let me do a slight. I'm gonna do a slightly lighter tone. <laughs> what up? What she thinks of Vibrant Poetry? It looks like she used the wrong baking tool. I don't know what that means. The wrong baking tool. Baking tool? What she melts? No, no, like she's confused. Like she used something wrong. Okay. Huh. Should her shoes have any any different color? Still like, I like the 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 grandma lipstick. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sisi says it's up to you, Mr. Art Guy. Well, thank you. But you're also Mr. Art Guys, so that's why I ask for this kind of question. Should I just do this? I'm not terribly happy with how her hair is blending in. I think I'm gonna change the color, boys. It's gonna be slightly not what the portrait has, but I think it could help me a little here. Hmm. It's still kind of too light. This won't read well. Let's make this just a tad darker. Maybe not too much darker. Okay, I think that might be more readable. It's a word, right? Readable. Huh. Actually, kind of like it like this halfway through. I don't know if I'm the only one, but I like it. I dig. I dig. I'm gonna leave it like this. Use this as an outliner here. I don't know. Should I try and put a mouth on her? You like this? It's the grandma kiss mouth. Hello. Look at the CPU. Ha! Huh, your scroll wheel is broken. Same here, my dude. When I zoom in and out, I use my um, what's the name of this thing? The well, the tablet square touchpad. touchpad. Exactly. I use the the touchpad whenever I need to zoom in and out, or use the little loop of thing, magnifying glass. I don't know what I do with her mouth, guys. This sounded more sexual than I wanted it to. It immediately throws her whole face off balance. Uh, like that? Hi, dearie. Uh, both my things dried out, so I can't see. If 
Add an in-between color between the lips and the skin color. Ooh. Yeah, instead of like a very like white lip color, I don't know. Okay, let's work with that. Uh, more in-between color. Where are we? Really, they're not that far off, actually. So let's go here. This color. I want it slightly there. Hmm? Like that? It is less aggressive. Yeah. I didn't mean it that way, but it looks cool too. What do you mean, like uh, having and a closer color, like here? And that just kind of looks like the predator or some shit. <laughs> Doing a, let's do a little recap then, since it's been a while. Hi guys, hi all you seven cool seven viewers. Uh, we're doing pixel art. You guessed it, boys. Right now, the characters we're doing, the character we're doing is this character. She is Varga. Her name is Varga, and uh, she is Varga. <laughs> But anyways, she's the owner of the inn and the uh, and within the video game Exauria that we're doing. And when you go to her inn with Scarlet, as Scarlet, you'll be able to rest there. She gives you some much needed and that rest usually entails, I think it's uh, refilling your either your health bar or your stamina or one of the two or the both of them maybe. I'm not entirely sure yet, just yet, but I can go a little bit darker. I should go with like dark ass boots, right? Boots they use when they're out and about. I mean, she has an end though. How are we doing it? What if I do this here? Huh? Yeah. But did you see what CP said? You see what CP said. I meant it like the normal lip color for the middle and in between the colors to the right and right. Ah, I, think I see what you mean. So in this case, it would be. I need to go a little bit over there. That would be. Huh? Eh? Is it just me or does it look like she has a pacifier in her mouth? A little bit. It kinda maybe. looks like a pacifier. I'm gonna keep this one for now then. She has big lip. It's okay. Thick ass lips. Okay, uh, I think she might be done. I don't know. Uh, how, long, how long have I been doing this one? It's been an hour. Huh? Since it's been an hour, I think I'm going to move on to Rizant. Maybe, yeah. I'm not sure if this is the final version we're going to get of her, but not bad so far not bad stop fucking mouse wheel <laughs> the pain of the mouse wheels god damn it cp my boy you always understood me didn't you okay 
should make this slightly lighter. Does that pop a little? I'm not sure if that pops. I don't know what popping is. Okay. Uh, what if I just... I'll think about you later. Right now, I think the basis of this is pretty good. I'm going to save this as a different ice sprite. So it'll, it'll be Varga. Let's call this Varga. Other dwarfs work. <laughs> Other dwarves work. That way, I have no qualms about putting the wrong one in the wrong place. This goes here. Okay. There we go. Okay. And now we see you. Now you see me. Now you don't. Now you see me. Now you don't. Now you see me. Now you don't. Okay, so what we want to achieve here with this guy This is Varga. This is Scarlet. Scarlet. And this is Ven. Yeah, the vendor is named Ven. Didn't see that coming, did you? Hello for the old ones, too. No, he, he said that no hello to all viewers. Ah. <laughs> Hello to all viewers. And thank, you for watching. and thank you for watching. And thank you for putting up with me. I am pretty boring. But at least I'm making a game. And games are cool, so. Yeah, no. Actually, I hope you do, because I don't. Okay, so let's start with uh, doing his general space of a face. Uh, this his head's gonna be there. Should go up here. It's a thick ass fucking head. Actually, this guy is going to be bald. This is the first in the with amongst the dwarfs. All the dwarfs I've done had ha have had hair. So let's see. <laughs> you know what else is pretty boring? School. <laughs> Yes, <laughs> ten thousand percent, my dude. I cannot fucking handle it anymore. Thank God we're done with that shit. It takes fucking forever, but eventually you will be done with that shit too, my dude. Don't worry. So let's just do do and do uh, do. Okay, I'm assuming he's gonna have some beards. Shut up, Epic! I don't want you. I don't want no fucking Fortnite. What kind of pleb do you take me for? Ha ha, mustache! Behold my mustache. Okay, so what is he wearing? What is he wearing? What is he wearing? wearing something fancy I think okay do, 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 do. it's going to have just, just general body shape I think I don't know I don't know what his undergarments are gonna look like we'll get to that in a second I think we have enough to start I like the way you did the mustache mustache does look Kind of fancy. I don't think it's it's not. I love his mustache, man. It's not the look that the, his mustache has there. So I'm still gonna try and do the curled up mustache, but I'm remembering this. You know what? You know who else has a good mustache? Not me. <laughs> hey. Hey, man. I, I can't. I can't confirm nor deny that. Oh, that I, can't, I haven't seen that mustache. But hey. It's not about the mustache, it's about what you do with it. 
What do you do with your mustache? Uh, I don't know. The lights? Ladies? <laughs> okay, wait. I don't think this is right. I don't like that. Okay. Get some cheeky ball. Wait, no. His head is a little... See, I now I have all this freedom of real estate now that he do, since I, now that I'm doing a, a hairless character, or no, not not hairless but bald, I have all this real estate of face to work with, and I I'm a little lost. But he does have the glasses. You can maybe okay, that works true, true, true. I'm gonna st get on, get on with the glasses. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> Seems a little silly. Rather silly. Now he just looks emo. Okay, maybe I'm gonna should work with a different. What would be a good color for his inside of the glasses? Trying to look kind of creepy, this guy. It's definitely getting creepy. <laughs> oh god. Let's see. Yeah, yeah no, I prefer the old, the old I prefer I prefer the old mustache, okay. But see now his eyes are way above than what they are should what they should be. Let me try just let me try moving them down to see how that looks. Eh, it just looks off. Yeah, with that mustache, he looks like Waluigi, like CP said. Well, do we not do do what's what's the public opinion opinion on Waluigi? Do do we like Waluigi? <laughs> If he got old and took off his hat, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that looks like Eggman. True there. If he was a librarian, ah, yeah, true. He does have Eggman vibes. Even true, true. And Mark that, yeah. Also, I, f I forgot about his beard. Yeah, don't forget the, the little goatee part. It's about that. I don't know, I kind of like the thickness there. Huh. What are you thinking here? I saw this guy and knew I was basically gonna work most of my ass off on the fucking mustache. Oh look, nightmares. Different way. Can I move his eyes down now? Huh. Okay, maybe on to something here, fellas. But did CP? He had an idea. Connect the glass frame, the glasses frames, and make it wider. Might not work too well, but still. The glass frames make it go out more outwards. So maybe like that. Let me see. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Uh huh. You know, I kind of dig it. It's giving me Edna, Mod uh, Edna Moda vibes. And I kind of dig them, honestly. Yeah. Yeah. 
Like the glass part of it. Did you mean like this, CP? It looks like Eggman again. <laughs> I mean, he was always going to look like Eggman. Except he has a beard now. Eggman got fancy. But I kind of like it though. Look, he has some a little... Do those eyebrows make him look a little bit less evil? Wait, while I'm here. I have... I can work with... Huh. I don't know what, what eye color he's supposed to have there, honey, but I'm gonna try something here. I didn't give him an eye color. It makes him look funny, Lamar. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this could be, a, this might be a little too out there. Yeah, he's kind of looking funny. He looks a little crazy. Yeah. What are we thinking? What are we thinking? I kind of like his face. Like this idea of having the eyes and even the slight Eggman-ish look. Maybe cheek him out a little. Now, now he looks extra Eggman. Eggman is fat. Can't go with fat. How are we doing, really? I mean, he should have a semi-messy hairdo, right? Yeah. He cute. I think his hair might be a little too much right now, <laughs> on this side especially. Or says, nah, looks like he's crazy or a scientist or both. We go that's in a the good, right direction. Yeah, that's a good that's a good one. That's a good direction. Let me I think I'm gonna delete this and this. Need to be this small. Okay. Actually no, I should have this like this and Okay. Let's move that guy over there. Let's move him up. Move up. Okay. I think this is something. Okay. Uh, what else? What else do I do here? Let's uh, start thinking about his clothes. What are his clothes, honey? Uh, what is well, that? What I is this? I pictured that being kind of like a sweater, but I'm not sure if like there's sweaters exist yeah in fantasy, so something of the sort. I, I guess there's there could be something similar to it. If it's a sweater, I'm gonna need his actual. It's something that fits his body re relatively. It's not loose. Yeah, it's not loosey goosey. Okay, so. It's fluffy, but not loosey goosey. Okay, let's go with. If I want him to, I want him to be th a bit on the thinner side com when compared with the other ones, right? Cause he's not a bulky man, he's a studious man. Yeah, he's on the skinny side. May I ask something? If yes, you may. How, How tall, tall are your are your characters pixel wise? Uh, that Scarlet's here, in fact, to answer that very question. But I I I had to cut her. She, I'm doing it. It's basically that scale of uh, 32 pixels in height. So if I were to say... 
can oh, I can show you here. Give me a sec. Xauria art characters. I think the white's a good one. Yeah, the white's basically a human. You sure you. I don't know if this is in the right scale right now, but I have some files that I yeah no. I need to sprite. Need to do this at about 50 percent um, i did some pixel i did some pixel art in uh, twice the size but that before that was before i realized that uh, we can actually alter that with in engine with no problem without losing any pro quality or anything so if i were just copy this here Control c New layer. Okay, so we'll think about it like that. Don't save. Okay. So yeah, this is thirty-two pixels. Uh, if I can show you real easy by just uh, let's pick some bright ass color, whatever. So like yeah. There's one pixel, two, one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, six. Wait, six, seven, eight, nine, <laughs> ten, eight. Wait, wait, fuck me. No, the tiles are 32 size. No, 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 I think ti the tiles are 30 pixel sized. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. They're all One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, oh, new fifteen. Hello, new follow. Thank you for the new follow. To Derp Man Reborn. Derp Man Reborn. Thank you for the follow. He's at. He's me at math exam. Yes. <laughs> I got ten percent. Damn, son. You need, I was just like him, man. You need a good. You need a better math tutor. You need a better math tutor, man. Tutor or I don't know, whatever. Teacher in general would be nice if we didn't need tutors, right? One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33. This guy has 33? Well, that was a bit of a whoopsie. But yeah, it's always around 30. Yeah, it's around 30 pixels in heights. And back to, to the thing. So I know I took too long, but I'm, I'm kind of slow, okay? That's why I'm not doing the programming. I need to actually give a freak about maths. Well, you know, giving a freak about maths might be optional. I never really gave a freak about maths, and because I had a decent math teacher, I passed the fucking thing. I'm not didn't go through it with shining stars but uh so percentage wise I think I was like 60 something percent that was enough to pass <laughs> but should I have that I think I went, do I want this extra pixel I think that extra pixel is too much less you uh, do Okay, so we got something going here. I'm gonna steal this guy's pants. Hope yeah, nobody minds, but I want the good pants. Also, I don't need you. This hey, this is extra. Let's wipe that clean. Okay. My characters are around fifty to sixty. That's cool, man. 
it all it's impressive either way man we're, we're we're all just dealing with pixels here and trying to organize them in a way that looks like something kind of humanoid it's it's praiseworthy no matter what the scale of what you're working with I'm, uh, this one we're gonna have the we're yeah pixels are at heart yeah like right this uh, this game in particular we're doing this scale but we have we're gonna try different scales too it's really just about choosing a style and going with it this so it's been a while since we went with oh yeah let's do this uh, I do human characters that don't look like humans. <laughs> hey man. Look at this beautiful human right here. But uh, it's it's like you just gotta lean into it, man. If you lean into it, you start creating a style there. I mean, <coughs> I've seen some atrocities in terms of trying to make humans and humanoid characters in video games and a lot of the times they manage to make it work so one that pops to mind is uh, wait like my in-game character looks like Ralze if he was blue and not fluffy wait Ralze I think that was I think that was the Dragon Ball one right let me just real quick check over here. I totally know who Ralze is. Oh, Ralze! Yeah, 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 yeah. From Delta Rune. Yeah, I remember him. Yeah, Ralze. Ralze is very cool. I like that character. I feel bad that I didn't remember his name. Ralze. So cool. This is my freaking consciousness. Hat on though. Hey man, I'm not sure what the problem is, man. Halze, Halze looks cool. I always liked the way he looked. He's a cool dude. If your character looks like him, it could be a lot worse. I think that's the way to go. Do we want that little shadow there? What do you think, guys? Do we want that shadow? Just that one little square of shadow built beneath his mustache. Uh -huh. Doesn't make a difference much. It has not woke up here yet. Maybe. It looks like a mouth to me. The mustache. The mustache looks like a mouth? That look less like the mustache shadow. Yeah, look, if that's what you said. Yeah. yeah. So I'm gonna leave it like this then. Okay. I think this kind of has a thing to it. I'm still not 100% happy on not knowing exactly what he's wearing. Maybe you should make like it keep going to the sleeves though. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, I, d I hadn't done his arms yet, sorry. <laughs> okay, but... Uh, what I'm gonna need here... I'm gonna need to diminish this. Do we have... Does he have, like, gloves or something? You have a little, little gloves. So no, why not? What do you think? Well, 
Want to know a fun fact? Give me your fun facts, man. Who doesn't love some good old fun facts? <laughs> hey man thank you but hey dude the whole not it's being it, it being too much to for your team to make that's just it's kind of on par man it's often you start out with an idea that's a little bit too much I mean, we also are going a little too much if we think about it. It's four people and we're trying to do an RPG, which is kind of insane. Hmm. I feel like I should, I need another tone, I think. Yeah, I need another tone. Let's go. Oh, Please say you will break fun facts. Okay, fun facts. If I if it weren't for getting killed by predators, dying to diseases, or dying due to the stress of molting, lobsters would grow forever considering they are essentially immortal. Damn son. <laughs> we could have we could be having giant laps though over here. some of the ideas I have got nobody to share with hit me with it baby hit me baby one more time I know twitch is gonna flag me because I mentioned the song in passing Okay, so gameplay wise, I'm thinking both standard RPG top down stuff and platformer like Mario and Luigi games. The battles are similar. Ah, the Mario and Luigi one. The uh, RPGs. Really like those, actually. So, like, you would be slip, uh, switching between a uh, top down orthogonal view and the uh, side scrolling per uh, jumpy jumpy perspective jumpy jumpy yes that's the official term ladies and gentlemen jumpy jumpy I just want to point out that you've been alive for an hour and a half yeah okay and you're almost done with that character as well I, I went with a, I did a little puffiness on his uh, shoulder things on his I, I don't know I, that feels medieval-ish to me like fancy medieval-ish yeah jumpy jumpy Biggest lobster, that's uh, biggest lobster ever recorded was over one meter long and weighed 19 kilograms. Now that's a fucking lobster dinner. Uh, CP, oh, yeah, you see, you just say, yeah, okay. Not really, I just make it going up and down, unless when it comes to, oh, okay, yeah, okay, you'd have like specific areas that would turn into platforming, okay. Uh, okay, okay, okay. I see. Yeah, you gotta, you kind of have to do that when you're trying to do the, the that kind of bland, 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 the blending of the two. It's kind of 
one one comp it's kind of a complicated thing to pull off actually i can understand why some of y'all crew aren't too jazzed about it but hey i mean i don't know how many people we have working on that but we were like we're four people and and a, a fifth one working in marketing we kind of have been we were kind of starting to maybe include other people but uh, we're not no we are only five people four working on the game and one on the marketing that's yeah it. yeah yeah literally it. see yeah we ca we considering in, in the future more people bringing more people in but it's literally not even in the close future we are five people <laughs> wait and the math is off dude me you Kado, character killer Codebreaker. My god, you're bad at math. We're five people. Ah. Shut the fuck up. Okay, okay. Whatever. So move on. Keep okay. Going. Whatever. Sorry. Five people. Uh, give me... Can someone please give me a little uh, advice here, though? Uh, I don't know if I go with this, these sleeves or these sleeves. The what? Like, if you can... I don't know if I go sleeves. Speak English. I don't know if, to, if I go with these sleeves or with these sleeves. I like those, they look medieval. This looks medieval? More than the other one, you say? I think so. Okay. Uh, yeah, maybe should I have the white thing on the middle? Maybe? I don't know if this is going to be easy to insert here. Uh, not too happy with this. Mm, I think I'm going to I'm not going to include the white part, honey. It kind of like looks like a bib. Okay. I'm not too happy with it. Yeah, I don't think it's required. Okay. Uh, wait, let me just re. I think I missed a few. Two people coding, one person writing game story, me, one person making art, me. Two people making music, one just giving inspirations for me and me and another guy. Hmm. Four people in total. Yeah. See, for people in total, I can understand the temptation of doing an RPG. That's what we that's what we ended up doing. Kind of regret it a little because it hurts to do this much work by four of by four of us. But I mean, if you got four people, maybe doing an RPG is possible. But maybe consider it also that to have that. The RP, the top-down RPG side of uh, type of game, and also have an, a 2D platformer in there, it may take up a lot of time. Like it may be, it may be too too much for your folks, for your group to do in for one game, you know. Oh yeah, y'all, y'all, cray, cray. Yep, it's it because it's it's hardcore, man. It's a lot of it's a lot to do. You're basically creating two games in one: <laughs> the platforming parts and the top-down parts. Oh, okay. We're planning to release it in a decade. Okay, that makes it a little more doable. Yeah. 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 With a decade to it, okay. But it is. Uh, it's good to think about these things like how much do you want certain features in what features do you think are the I guess you just start with doing the the what they call the huh? oh, okay, okay. Uh, what uh, how much I long how long have I been here two hours 
I don't know, almost two hours. But the thing is, the things are so complex that it will probably take longer than we expect. Yeah. That's the thing about making games, man. And if you'll, you'll expect a certain level of difficulty and then random ass shit will get thrown your way and you'll be wondering, well, should I have done something different? Wait, let me just do the... Does this work? I think this looks nice, a little bit, a little shade on the on the glasses, right? You know? What do you think, honey? Okay. Okay. The uh, thing is, uh, yeah. At least you're not the one coding, dude. Dude, you have no idea how hard I can relate to that feeling. <laughs> Cause I I suck at coding. I've tried in the past. I did a thing that was barely functional, but yeah. Uh, well, look, dude. Best of luck to all of your team. We are. I think we're gonna wrap it up on my end here. Oh wait, question. What's the question, my good sir? The question. The question. The anticipation. <laughs> Sound font? We do not know what sound font is. Uh, character killer? Are you there? Can you uh, respond to that? <laughs> so, okay. I mean, we have, I think, I'm not entirely sure what we're doing, right, what we're doing for how is he getting done, it done. Because right now we got the, our writing man uh, character killer doing our sound sound effects uh, hi uh, Wolf, uh, basically he's doing um, yeah. yeah he was asking like if we do we use sound fonts on the soundtracks I don't think so I don't know okay the chat wasn't loading okay but he sees, he sees it now yeah, I know that the so that the music we used on Red Run was like uh, he 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 grabbed this piano thing I had played and he edited it, edited it to hell and back to be creepy and cool. Yeah. Uh, I'm not sure. I think I think he did use some sound some distorted sound effects there too. Like the instruments from other games, uh, we I think the the most we've used, and we're thinking of, uh, are just basically those packages that you can get online that are for free that are like open source for anyone to use on their games. We basically pick, we grab, we grab those, and I think we edit them, right? Yeah, it was being done for Xia as remixing and sound manipulation from pre-existing sound effects. So far, no sound effects. All right, nice. Yeah. Well, yeah, we might need it, but it's a uh, it's a it's a work in progress. So, uh, to wrap it up here, guys, this is what we did today. We did Varga, a gal here, who is who is cute. No matter how what you say, CP, she's cute for her age. I tap that. <laughs> But uh, yeah, uh, we did her and we did our cartographer character. They're both dwarves, so they're both short, so they're shorter than Scarlet. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll probably still change some f aspects of them, cause uh, you know it's 
it's a part of it. It's a part of the process. You want to uh, polish the diamond, like our programmer says. They look derpy. Derpy is the new charm. Hey, man. I like my derps. My derps. But I'll probably still work on these anyways. Just, you know, fine-tuning it, polishing the diamond till they're really good. I'm pretty happy with the face of the cartographer, with, with his head. And I think his shirt kind of fits that fancy-ish medieval type of clothing. Not too sure, but I don't know. And I'm kind of glad I'm okay with the the with Varga. I may alter something about her face because her face is still not sitting quite right with me. But it's a process, guys. We'll get there when we get there. In the meanwhile, thank you for accompanying us through the journey, the creative process, and how we, and giving following us too. Thanks for the follows that we got here, and uh, be sure to check out our itch, which is already on in in our chat. And there you can play a game. Another live stream. What? What do you mean? The the ones on the chat, right? What the fuck? Do want me to do the outro? No, what the fuck? Just, I'm just gonna say the... Well, let's, why'd you interrupt me? <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. I'm just gonna say... I'm go I was just saying, check out our, our itch. It's right there on the chat. You can play our al the two alphas we, are at, we have out on there. Uh, the Alpha Vexaria, the Alpha the Red Run. Check out our Discord. Join in. Talky talky. Fun fun. Chat with us all. Uh, and we also put on some cool memes in there. So it, there's always that. Check out our Instagram too. Yes, it's a goodbye, CP. I'm sorry. Need to go make some dinner. <laughs> would be would love to stay here forever, but my stomach calls uh but yeah check out our check out our rich check out our discord check out our instagram too as it's uh it's cool we put on some content there showing our progress and the game developing and some memes again check out our twitter we also put some nice memes there and some showings of our progress uh, check out our facebook too and i think that's all of them and our YouTube, check out our YouTube channel where we put on our the highlights of our streams and trailers and other stuff. Thank you all for coming. Thank you all for watching. We'll see you later next week at the same hour. Probably not me, but one of us will will catch up with you. So, oh, thank you for following our Twitter. And uh, well, thank you for coming. Thank you for thanks for subbing. Thanks for watching and. Bye-bye, you guys.